camera junkies, it's Karen. I'm with James and Isabella's in the back. We are headed to Las Trompas, not, not National Park, Regional Park. Yep. And uh, last year this time there were a lot of California puppies on the hillside out here. So we're headed back out to see if we can find it this year. Um, so tag along. <laughs> Bottles of beer on the wall, 99 bottles of beer. Take one down, pass it around. 98 bottles of beer on the wall, 98 bottles. This is going to be a long drive. <laughs> <laughs> it's a gorgeous drive all the way out here to Las Trompas. It's hard to believe we literally live about 10 15 minutes from this spot. All right, we're basically here. Starting to see some cars, and I'm looking up to my right. I don't know if you guys can see it, just below the fence line and right above the fence line, there's lots of poppies. See them right here after this bump sign? They look like tiny little orange specks probably from your perspective. But that are those are the California poppies we're looking for. So we're going to park and get up to the top of that hill and see what uh, what's up there. Oh! Wow. Cut that out. Okay, here we are. We're at the uh, parking area for the Los Trompas Regional Park. Where we're going actually is, you wanna to point to where we're going? That way. <laughs> that way. Follow that white pickup truck and it's off in those hills. That's where we're going. Hopefully that's where we'll find some really cool looking poppies. Good. Nearly there. We're nearly there. Can you see Karen up there? Karen and Bella ahead on the trail. Bella's way up there. She's already gone. But uh, I think the hike's going to be worth it because I think we see some pretty cool looking poppies up here at the top of the hill. Always wear socks, hiking boots, and pants. Not that <laughs> when you're hiking. Didn't think it through. Okay, we made it to the top of the hill. There's Bella up there already. And there's Karen off in the distance. Let me turn this around so you can see. There's Karen off in the distance. We've got a whole field full of poppies here that uh, ought to make some good pictures here at some point. So now the chore begins. We gotta, get up there. we gotta find the right composition, the right framing. Where do you wanna go? Up there. You wanna go all the way up there? No, just kinda where Bella is. Kinda where Bella is, okay. Well, there's a whole lot of hillside to work with, so let's get to it. So I'm frustrated because I wanna get, I can see already what my shot is gonna look like. What is it? I want a poppy in a third, lower third, and then I want that view of the valley a slightly bokeh maybe behind it. Something over here with all these poppies. Yeah. Yeah, but to do that, we need to go up there and there is no really real path, not wearing hiking boots and socks. Mm. So That's I think I'm problem. gonna head that direction and see if I can fake it. Okay, good luck. Thanks. <laughs> you're going with mommy or you're staying here? I'll go with mom. Great. <laughs> of course you're going with mom. Mom's always the favorite. What's that about? <laughs> oh my god. Oh wow, look at this. Don't step on the poppies. Not. Don't step on the poppies. Not, look, not stepping on the poppies. Look at it. Oh yeah. It's like a thingy. It's the beginning of what's going to be a poppy, huh? Yeah. But it looks like a Cheerio pierced by a leaf. <laughs> it does. The Cheerio okay. has been impaled. Here. Oh, you think you found something? Yeah. In that view? Yeah. But I gotta get this up, up there. there. <laughs> That's the challenge. Go for it. We want to watch. There's a spider web. Yeah, you should lay in that. Spider. 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 Why does it have to be spiders? So I found a really great spot. The sun has left us for the most part now. But when I was sitting here earlier, this poppy is just starting to open up. 
and I can't believe it, but there's actually small dew drops on it, which just makes me so happy. So my shot, if I can get the camera back on, I did uh, lower third just like I wanted, lower third, bottom left, lower third. I had the um, backlit flower and then I had the backlit grass behind me and then obviously these backlit hills. And I snapped a shot and I'm really happy with it. There's one that I like a lot. And then as the light was leaving, I zoomed in on the flower, still doing the left third side of the frame, uh, zoomed in quite a bit and got an even better shot of the dewdrops. So I'm excited to see if it turns out. There's a tiny little breeze, so there's always that chance it won't be tack sharp, which will upset me. <laughs> but um, these poppies really aren't open really yet. So, I mean, in a week or so, we can definitely come back and um, hope there'll be a lot more. Okay, camera junkies, I think we're done. The sun is going down and it's about 6.30. I think we've been out here a good hour or so. Um, this is a good example, a good lesson. I mean, we only had an hour. We ran some errands, still have to go to the grocery store and figure out dinner. I'm taking Isabella to see a movie, but I thought, you know, I know these poppies are out here. It's a beautiful day, great light. So we grabbed it and I'm really excited. I really, really think I got some good shots. So we'll see. Mm -hmm.